you guys. High five, high five. <laughs> Welcome to NAV. <laughs> So I was walking down the road and I just found Laura. Oh, fun. Hanging out and she needed some help and I was gonna come help you and I figured maybe we could swap some help for some stuff. A little help exchange, what can I help with? So my friend Laura Stitzer is an actress and she's coming to teach me how to make an audition tape. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I met her at improv. Oh. But we thought maybe you could use your improv skills to help us like get into character for this thing. I think that'd be a lot of fun. So yeah. let's make some popcorn bags some popcorn and I'll teach you how to do some stuff. Yeah. Beautiful. But I heard that your popcorn is like the best. Uh, Nap's popcorn is pretty great. We put a lot of heart into how we make it. We use great uh, ingredients. Like instead of butter, we use coconut oil and a bunch of stuff like that. We just put a lot of care into everything we make. So people like our popcorn, we like making it. Awesome. Well, let's go make some. Let's do let's it. Let's go make some popcorn. <sighs> All right, we made it. We're at the popcorn station. What are we doing here? Well, right now we are about to do a little bit of drizzling. We have two types of popcorns here at NAVS. We have flavor and then we have drizzles. And drizzle is anything that has chocolate or peanut butter or milk chocolate, white chocolate, all that stuff. We're making Dark Island right now. That is our best seller by far. I make this all day, every day. It is our regular caramel corn, which is delicious. And then we're gonna drizzle some dark chocolate on it. And then after that, we're gonna do some sea salt. But I'm gonna show you guys how to properly drizzle, okay? Okay, drizzle. What? Is there a technique or you just- There is a technique. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna start flat and then go straight. That's how we do it here. So you get a big scoop of this and then start flat. Get it on there. And then at the end, you're just gonna go straight up and down. All right, show, okay. me your, show me your drizzle. Oh man. Let's see what we got. Do we got any uh, characters to play through? Oh, we... yeah, wait, I'm oh. supposed to help you guys right. with character. All right, first one just says Kim Jong-un. Uh, no. Uh, <laughs> this is Maria. <laughs> like, Maria. <laughs> Maria is from New Jersey. Now it says 50s or 60s. Are you asking us to do it in the time period, 50s or 60s? Or is she 50? Age. That's her age, okay. Yep. She's a grandma, she loves to cook, tries to add a little bit of Italy love with everything she cooked. Okay, how do you do that? How do you, do you dig in for uh, Italian grandma? Vi I visualize and then take a step, one step back, because my visualizing is gonna be too much. Like, it's gonna be like, Giuseppe, got a word about the board. And then, but that's an offensive caricature. Beep a da boopa. Beep a da boopa. <laughs> And then you take a step back and bring it into reality. So I uh, had an Italian uh, step grandma, so I'm gonna go off of uh, that a little bit. Just a very, very kind and whatever spirit. I have a customer. <laughs> <laughs> so if you're if you're an old Italian grandma, it's more like uh, this to me, Mario. Perfect. Yeah. I put uh, too much of the chocolate on the stuff. It needs more Italian seasonings. Why your your Mario got Irish real right? quick? I don't <laughs> know why I have the Italian seasoning. All right, we're doing a new one. I can't do accidents. <laughs> can't, can't do, do accidents. accidents. All right, so we're doing Charlie. Charlie's from London, England. Charlie is clumsy but well intended. These are so <laughs> so cute. okay, Mr. Bean. I'm um, putting the popcorn drizzle on and. Once you heat it up in the micro, then you uh, take this little paddle here. Do you, oh wait, so do you guys know the English phrase that you should say when you want to get the good English accent? Uh, I'd like a proper cup of coffee with a proper cup of tea from a proper coffee kettle pot. Okay. I need a proper pop of popcorn <laughs> from the proper pop and if you guys have an English audience at all, they're going to be furious by this. <laughs> they're going to be like, we don't talk like that. We know. <laughs> all right, keep going, keep going. And okay. then we're going to put some salt on it. While we salt, I'm going to give you another character. <laughs> These are so specific. <laughs> when you're like, I'm going to do characters. I thought it was like, yeah, Italian grandma, English guy. You're like, Lawrence has been from the hard knock streets. Those, it literally says, those street smart. <laughs> Takes no nonsense from anyone. Loves showing off. Oh, your handwriting's true. It's not Lawrence, it's Laverne. <laughs> showing off her dance moves. Laverne makes popcorn. Well, Laverne's here making 
popcorn, and then we're gonna do a little bit of salt on it. <laughs> oh yeah. So here's the sea salt that we put on top. Not too much, because you don't want it to taste like salt. You want it to taste like caramel corn, dark chocolate with a little bit of sea salt. So Laverne or Lawrence would be like... Mm. From, well, you know, when you grow up in the tough streets of Milwaukee. <laughs> what, can anybody do a Milwaukee accent? When I do Milwaukee, I'm like, oh, don't you know? That's what oh. I think. Yeah, don't you know? Don't you know? Don't don't you know a good casserole when you see one? Oh yeah. Yeah. Again, you're going Irish again. <laughs> Why are they all Irish? <laughs> They're all Irish. See, the thing is, like, you could do if you did like those accents you can't do. But if you wanted to do like a Japanese accent, you'd get away with it because it's not going to be Japanese. No, it's gonna they're be Irish. all Irish. You're like, look at me from Tokyo. <laughs> I'm a young Japanese man, don't I you know? So we got the drizzle down, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, and you guys are good at it. Good enough. But we have some actual characters built into a script that we're going to work through with Laura when she comes. So Perfect. maybe let's take a look at that. Do we want to go do that in the next Step? That's what I think we should do. We'll go in the other room, we'll bag up, and we'll bag up what we just made. We'll go over a script. Okay, awesome. Let's Great. go. Well, we're over here now. The bagging station. The bagging station. So I'm gonna teach you guys how to bag while we run these scenes, which is actually perfect because this technically is the Meisner form of acting. And it's the idea of having an activity going on while you're acting because it's gonna draw something out of you. Same way like we were drizzling happy and drizzling upset. So first thing I gotta show you okay. is how to bag popcorn. Uh, my script is in the way, but that's okay. The script's never in the way. It's just <laughs> the words that you create scenes with. Camera's the camera. Right? Oh, that one? Okay. <laughs> so these are our nav popcorn bags. What we're gonna try to do is fill them up to the top. We have the Dark Island and the Wellesley that we made earlier. And so one thing about us here at NAVS, and not to belittle anyone else, we like to bag all the way to the top. You will see other ones, you know, when you open a bag of chips and there's like half of it full. <laughs> yes, no. Yeah. You know, when you open With a bag of chips there. and it's like half full. We right. hate that here. So we fill it up all the way to the top. To bring it up, you're going to seal it. And then that's a finished Dark Island right there. Firm, full, all that good jazz. I'm gonna set up the exposition for this scene. So the scene that you guys are doing, you're two detectives, I guess, and you're arguing. So I'm gonna do the exposition at the front. All right, the scene is a hard-boiled cop duo are investigating a crime scene. Charles Clover, who's Charles? That would be me. Okay, Charles Clover, you are a witty and aloof detective. And then Alistair Alexander, I'm guessing that's you, Laura, is his foil, and you are determined to get the job done right. Yeah. So while bagging, <laughs> let's see the scene. Ready, set, action. All right, this job isn't for the faint of heart, kid. You're give. I'm, I'm giving you one less chance <laughs> to back out. I told you, detective. I want to bring these guys to justice, and I'll do anything. Fine, but don't go forgetting who's in charge. I don't need a greenhorn slowing me down, you follow? Detective, my research led me here to Nav's secret lair. Wait, Nav's has made its way into the script? <laughs> <laughs> yes, this is the secret hideout. Oh, Of the I Nav clan. Okay. All the evidence points to here. So let's bag up some of this evidence as quickly as possible before they find out. <laughs> okay, well you can get on that. Like I smell something over here. We'd like to take this time for a disclaimer. Nav Popcorn has never once nor will ever be part of a crime organization. <laughs> we just make popcorn. This is a dramatized scene. Please know that we are not violent people. Go ahead. <laughs> you get on that. I smell something over here. Fireball, Dark Island, Halapopno. I think they had an inside job. There must be a code hidden in here somewhere. <laughs> I didn't realize you guys were in the script around popcorn. Detective! <laughs> I found something! <laughs> it's in the dark island. End scene. Oh my god. <laughs> That's so great. When you said you had a scene, I'm like, oh, they pulled something from like a movie or something like that. They're working it out. You okay. wrote a scene Question. about Question. Nav. That's so great. Question. Is this full enough? No. no. Not even, not even full. 
Look at this. Look at how bad that is. It's terrible. <laughs> well, I think you guys have a long way to go before people start enjoying popcorn at your movies. But <laughs> this isn't full enough. That's not full enough either. You guys this have a while to go before you work at Navs. Well, but appreciate you helping us. I'm, yeah, I, I appreciate you guys helping me out. Uh, but I'm gonna leave you with a professional right now. I gotta go take care of something. She's gonna help you guys get even better at acting. And then we'll see how the bag goes. Okay, awesome. <laughs> Laura! Hi! <laughs>Well, we know that you have a party to go to tonight. You're doing a viewing of your latest movie? Yes, a private screening. It's for cast and crew of the movie Sendero. That was directed by Michael Torres. I play a clueless mother, a little pretentious, not thinking my son's doing anything wrong type of, type of thing. Well, here's the thing. Zachary's starting football this summer, and the coach refuses to give any of the kids playing time without a C average. Yes, ma'am. Well, I don't agree with that. Oh, me either. I think they should at least have a B minus. Well, I just started recently um, substitute teaching, so I got some show and tell for you ladies. So I'm gonna show you some things that you can use to get started. First of all, all you need is a nice phone, iPhone. This was, I think, $9. All self tapes are horizontal. What I do sometimes is I just kind of diffuse it, I pop it up a little bit and have a light come off the ceiling. And then all you need is a blank wall. So this place would not be well. A closet door, you know, whatever. Just something that's uh, gray, white, light blue. We have a side here that we would like to practice for you to help teach us how to do this. Okay. And if maybe if you can just walk us through it and you could go first and show us how this works. Okay. So this scene, 90s style sitcom, Judith, a recently divorced woman in her 40s, runs a popcorn shop. How convenient. <laughs> <laughs> She's training a new worker, Wanda, whose clumsy and bright personality is getting on her nerves. Okay, so this is internal. So INT means it's an internal scene. Judith is showing Wanda how to drizzle toppings on popcorn. Well, mm -hmm. let's give it a shot. Okay, cool. Right, so this is how you pour the chocolate over the popcorn. Quick motions like this. We don't give our customers the option of dipping, just as my ex-husband did. So, make sure to get every last piece. Every last one. Unseen. You guys ready to try? <laughs> <laughs> as ready as I'm gonna be. Okay. All right, looking to the left of the Slide camera. The Got it. Right. right. So, so this, this is how, is how you're going to pour chocolate, chocolate over, over the popcorn. The popcorn. Quick, Quick motions, motions like this. Like this. We don't we give, our give our customers, customers the option, option of, of dipping, dipping, just as my ex-husband did. Like so ex make sure you get did. every last one. So make sure every last piece, like every last piece, has chocolate. And same. Excellent. You guys did great. That was so much fun. I was not really sure I could do that at all. So thank you so much. Those pointers were really helpful. You guys knocked it out of the park. Yes. yes. Well, we have been here all day slaving, making making you a gift for your party. We wanted to oh. present you with this. Oh my gosh, this is so Laura, sweet. Laura, I don't, I don't think that's enough. What about this? <laughs> <laughs> Well, this has been a lot of fun. Get to your party. And before you go, though, tell us what else you have going on. Tell our viewers where they can find you. The Sundara movie is hitting the festival circuit, so that won't be out for a while, but I guarantee it'll be streaming soon. Um, it's I really, I, this a great movie. I just did a music video with uh, a local artist. His name is Ian Brown. Wonderful actor. Well, he's acting, actually. Um, producer, writer of music, and it's called uh, When You're Home. Very moving, I will tell you that. I will give you that waiver right now. You get your <laughs> tissue. But it is a beautiful, very beautiful video and a beautiful song. So yeah, you can see When You're Home on YouTube as well. Okay, awesome. awesome. And you'll let us know when your movie is officially out. Oh, you'll watch. be the first and second. Yay. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you guys. This was this was so much fun. I really appreciate it. Yeah, very much. Appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, I had fun. Uh, something we always ask here is, are we still having fun? So I'm glad you are. But Laura, are you having fun? I'm having a great time. I'm actually sad that it's over. Me too. <laughs> this went really quick. Hope all of you tuning in are having a great time too. Please be sure to like, subscribe, and follow as we check out America's Next Best Places to Live. We'll see you around Syracuse. Bye. So this is
is how you pour the chocolate. Over the popcorn. Quick motion like that. Oh, man. Forty's got it. Runs a popcorn shop. Training a new worker. Jump in there. Right, so this is how we pour the chocolate over the popcorn. <laughs> Right, so this is how you pour the chocolate over the popcorn. <laughs> right, so this is where we pour the chocolate over the popcorn. <laughs> okay, get into character. Judith, channeling Judith. Tell me when to, tell me when to start acting. 